was really good y'all yeah. it's been a minute um i've not done one of these in a long time so here's a really quick update on how to search for an apartment using neighbor Pudongsan or neighbor real estate um i know there are a lot of apps like jikbang which can help you identify area or different um options in your area to shop around but if you just want to make sure that your rent is uh, or make sure that you know the options you want to search in a more general area on your computer here is a really really good resource now i don't know where you are it doesn't really matter let's say you're in Gwangju. basically once you use this app you can just focus on where you live and what you want now here in Gwangju, we have a bunch of different options um let's zoom in a bit okay so your the default for neighbor Pudongsan is uh office tells and apartments and if you're looking for an office tell or, or an apartment then that's good i mean yeah but if you just take a quick look at the prices here a lot of them are really expensive so um for example like this place they're selling an apartment for yugo kuchon which is using a very maybe not necessarily realistic but um rough exchange rate that's about like 700k maybe 650 usd and this is 47 pyong or 156 uh, square meters which is actually quite big but anyways um, i'm assuming that most of my viewers are not trying to buy an apartment right now so one thing you can do is click on office tell office tells are smaller buildings that usually have um, a sangha or like a, a commercial area on the first floor and then uh residential up top uh yeah see it's a lot cheaper so again you still get uh, some of these buy and sell meme just means buy and sell um if you're looking to rent what we can do is start using the first filter which is kore uh meme we don't want jonche jonche just means all sorry um so let's say you want worse which is monthly rent here are the things there once you click on it it just very much narrows down uh what your options are uh now let's take a look at I don't know, this place okay um here if we take a look at the price you'll see it broken down into three parts the first part here is your pojungum or your deposit and the second part is your worse or your monthly rent now this is actually a pretty decent price considering what you're getting right you have a decent chupang little rest area this looks to be about chupang Pyeongpyeong? Oh, okay, that's bigger than I thought. Maybe the bathroom's bigger than I could see. But anyways, um, this is not that bad. But if you really, really want to narrow down your uh, your options based on your ability to pay, this is a really good way to do it. So, uh, with the bojunggum, or like I said, there are two different types of things. You have bojunggum, and you have worse. Uh, Bojunggum is your deposit, Worse is your monthly rent, I already said that, um, but here's how it works. I think this is a lot easier because one, in the office style apartment area, it puts it starts you off at like 50k, uh, which is not really helpful for a lot of us. So I'm going to go with one room and two rooms, which are smaller, um, like smaller types of dwellings. Uh, once again, we're going to filter for monthly rent, Worse. And now we have a variety of bojunggums and monthly rent. So let's say you have 5k. Fine. Just like a, a rough 5k to pay as your deposit. Uh, don't worry, it's not like North America if you're from there where, where the landlords will just absolutely screw you out of your entire deposit just because they want to go on vacation. Um, here there are laws and it's generally, in my experience over the past 10 years, um, people don't really get screwed that hard. I don't know if that's consistent for everybody. It all always depends on the landlord, but uh, Yeah, there are laws in place to protect you as a renter. Anyway, so let's say your Pojunggum is 500. It'll give you all of your options under 5k uh, Let's be a little more specific. Ooh, why did I uh, Yeah, see everything's 5k or under now let's say you also only are willing to spend about 400 a month here are your options it generally narrows it down significantly to 
uh, what is in your price range. Um, let's say you want to look in this area here. 2K, 250 a month for uh, an apartment that looks like this. Hard to trust these pictures, to be honest. You got have to call the um, real estate person and actually go take a look. But this is this is Pyong, which is really good. I mean, if you're living alone, it's fine. I think these are all pretty similar size. Oh, maybe the same building. Even. Uh, oh yeah, well, I clicked on this one circle. But anyways, uh, yeah. So you can obviously shop around and see uh, what's good for you. Here, this is a 500 or sorry a five thousand dollar deposit with 380 obviously not nearly as competitive as this considering the sizes are pretty similar but i mean it's up to you it depends on what you're looking for now one thing that you should always remember to look at is the quality quality is basically your maintenance fee those can go from anywhere i've paid 50 a month in the past to up to the apartment that I'm living in right now is like 170 a month. So if you're considering rent and considering your actual budget, always make sure to filter out Qualibi as well. Because there are some places where you'll get where the Qualibi is like as much as somebody else's rent. And uh, yeah, yeah, see, I just brought it down to what 18, so 180 bucks, and that already made an option disappear somewhere here. Oh. Where did you go? Ah, there you go. I don't know which one it was. But anyway, the number dropped quickly from 2 to 1. This one went from 3 to 2 because the quality B is expensive. And you need to keep, if you're budgeting, you need to keep that in mind. Here's like under 50 bucks a month for uh, your maintenance fee. There. Here is, let's say you only budget about... Let's say 450 bucks a month for your rent these are all the options that would fit you in this given area um, finally you have different things like a full option if you want it i don't know top which is like rooftop yeah they don't have them so that type of stuff i don't think is really necessary to know i mean if you want you can use papago but uh, these filters really 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 useful really helpful and really easy now once you've actually decided on a place you can either ask somebody to help you call this number which will help you get in contact with the uh, real estate agent who you can meet and you can ask them to go see the actual unit sometimes they'll just give you the password and you can go on your own walk in and see what it looks like if they're not available um, but yeah, always view the apartment first as well and see how furnished it is and do all that type of stuff. But, oh, it's over eight minutes already. I hope this was helpful. I'm not going to keep going for too long because that's really all you need to know, right? Uh, once again, find where you are. Let's say you're in, I don't know, let's go to Ulsan. Shout out this Korean life. Where's Ulsan? Can I not read? Oh, there you go. Yeah, here's Ulsan. Uh, let's say you're in... Where's Ulsan Bay? I have no idea where Ulsan Bay is. Jinggo? Namgo? Maybe Namgo? Holy crap. This is not helping me see anything at all. Okay, anyways. Uh, I don't know. Let's say you're here near Xinjiangzhou. And you want to look for a one room. All you gotta do, click on one room. Then sort. Click on... What does it say? which is monthly rent and uh, I scroll I think I zoomed too much yeah okay there there's a lot more uh, you can also filter for Pojungum uh, let's say this Pojungum 500 uh, maximum $500 deposit or $5,000 deposit with a maximum worth say of 300 there you go these are your options uh, also like I said keep your maintenance cost down and there you go your maximum payment is going to be a $5,000 deposit with roughly $370 in maintenance and rent. These are your options. Click here. Oh, no, I don't want to go all the way. Uh, here. Oh, okay. That's not what we want. Yeah, this is what we want. Small place, but considering the price you're paying for it, not too bad. All right, that's it for me. Take it easy. Peace. Bye. Love you.